Trusting God, part one. Do you trust God? This is an introduction to a series on trusting God, and the topics we'll cover in this series are discussed more fully in the two books, The Glory of God is Intelligence and Seek Ye This Jesus. They're both available on Amazon.com uh, for print cost and in free PDF form at upwardthought.blogspot.com. I encourage you to check them out. They're also both on Kindle. So a simple question, and you might jump to the answer of yes, but do you trust in God? And I encourage you to deeply think about this in total honesty and sincerity. And here are some questions to help you think about what it really means to trust in God. Do you hesitate or doubt when God asks you to do hard things? Is there a limit to what you would consider if he asked you to do it? Do you knowingly act, think, or feel differently? than your most sincere idea of God? Do you complain? Do you fear anything or anyone? Do you ever feel depressed, angry, anxious, covetous, or lustful? This is not an exhaustive list, but all of these things have their root in a lack of trust in God. By obtaining trust in God, you can overcome all of those things and more, you can have true, deep peace beyond what the world can offer. You can have sustaining joy, contentment, and you can find rest. And all of these things do not happen in the absence of what we face in this world. But through trusting God, you can have all of these things in spite of everything the world can throw at you. You overcome the world by trusting in God. Overcoming the world and trusting in God are the same thing. Stay tuned for other videos in this series.